Well, here we are after two and a half years. This channel's finally reached one of its major targets and reached 1,000 subs. And I want to say a huge thank you to everyone who's stuck with me till this point and want to send a massive sloppy kiss to all those who actually congratulated me when we reached the target and I was surprised at how many did and indeed how many contacted me by DM. And that really touched me, so uh, thanks again. Though when 3.2 billion have access to the internet, it does beg the question why it took so long to get a thousand subs. And I know I'm showcasing a nine-year-old game with established creators like ESO, Epic Nace and Fudge Muppet etc. But with approaching 250,000 views and 249,000 not subscribing, I, I, I can only conclude that my work still has a long way to go, which indeed was a second goal when I started this channel, and that was to produce and edit quality stuff. Now I do see uh, some improvement, but I'm super self-critical and recognise I have a long way to go and really, really hope you guys stay with me on this journey, which kind of brings me how you guys can help me uh, and help the channel grow into something quite decent, and that's to critique my work. If you can think of ways that I can do things better or things I'm just simply doing wrong, let me know. Extra eyes are incredibly helpful and I never take offence and indeed I welcome it. So don't be considerate, just swing away. And believe me when I say this, the 100 or so of you that comment regularly are the ones that really keep me going. Um, when you get a little bit tired and uh, your enthusiasm starts to dip because it's a, this is a long road and YouTube is a lot harder than you guys actually really or a lot of you guys sorry um actually realize okay a few things uh, that are important um skyrim is an aging game and eventually it will be replaced by other stuff unfortunately it's a sad but inevitable truth and i don't want all this hard work to go to waste so i really would appreciate your input on what direction the channel could take so i can kind of start planning ahead and hopefully uh, keep this whole thing alive Okay, all that being said, back to the present, and I've hopefully got a couple of videos coming out over the next week or so. One's going to be a guide video, a short one, as I'm trying to get a comprehensive list for anyone new to the game, and I will probably start doing some of the older Creation Club stuff, uh, just so I've got a full list covered. I'm also going to be going back to the idea where I do blind playthroughs on stuffing games in my games library that I just haven't played yet. Now I did this with Dishonored and it was a complete disaster. Um, some videos only having three or four views. And so what I'm going to do this time is release them in blocks, say four to five videos in one hit. And I'm going to be starting with one of the most fun games I've played in ages and that's Tales from the Borderlands. And it's a really great story driven game and I'll be adding no commentary to it, just, just let the story uh, do the talking. But you know, I've, I've got a whole library full of games that I'm not playing so uh, I just want to kind of have an excuse to actually, you know, not have all that money sitting there, so I just play them and I'll put them up there. Anyway, the amount of views of them doesn't matter, but don't think I'm not going to be Skyrim anymore because I'm um, putting these up. Okay, now if any of you know of any other story-driven games uh, of, of the quality of Tales from the Borderlands, then let me know and I'll try and do them as they're a hell of a lot of fun to, to play and watch. Um, so there you go. I've uh, hit one of my targets, a long way to go for my second one, and I've probably got one of the best communities on YouTube. Happy days. And thanks a million to each and every one of you, and I really mean that from the bottom of my heart. Genuinely, I really mean that. And I'll see you guys later. Love you.